Hey, I'm Lucas Graybill from High School Musical, and you're watching Ed Magic TV. It's simple to see it's Ed Magic TV, so the world can believe it's Ed Magic TV. It's simple to see it's Ed Magic TV, so the world can believe it's Ed Magic TV. Lucas, I couldn't feel better being here at this wonderful film festival with all the great people here. <laughs> it feels great, doesn't well, it? Let's talk about your project. You know, there's not too many young actors that really are doing their own projects at this point. And you've accomplished that. Let's talk about that. Well, thank you. Um, I, you know, I'm, I'm all about just doing everything and getting out there and doing as much as I possibly can. And I can't just sit still, uh, I gotta be working, so I started my own production company. We've been making short films and music videos for the last two years. So what's the name of these two films that are here at the Temecula Film Festival? Uh, Chuckle Boy mm -hmm. and uh, The Real Son. Chuckle Boy is about what? Uh, it's about an actor who meets an alien who wants to take his place here on Earth. Sounds interesting. <laughs> yeah, it was a lot of fun. Do you believe aliens are real? Uh, sure, why not? Why not? <laughs> and what about the other one? <laughs> Uh, the other one is about a, a father and son who are uh, kind of conflicting um, uh, personalities, you know, uh, trying to get along. Let's talk about the, the movies that you've done. And uh, a lot of people get trapped in that television syndrome. And it's good because it's a steady paycheck, but it's not the same as doing a big movie and, you know, getting that big part, you know, like a Will Smith or whatever, what have you. Let's talk about some of the movies you've been in and the ones that you really think sh show your best work and also that uh, maybe give a message to the public. Well, uh, you know, I was in high school musicals and uh, of course is what brought me here today. It's what, you know, allowed me to give uh, that extra time and, and experience to create my own production company. So uh, without that, I wouldn't be here. Um, but, you know, uh, I, I recently did a film uh, with Gus Van Zandt called Milk and uh, I learned more than in doing that movie than uh, anything combined and it's just a, a, a wonderful artistic uh, education for for really great storytelling so I hope to kind of follow in that footsteps but I, I absolutely love all of it. When you do the acting uh, because now you're also a director right and a producer. Right yeah. So do you feel you got an edge on doing some of that? Well, I hope so I mean coming from an actor's point of view I know uh, you know certain things that I, I need to look forward and uh, you know how to build a story correctly and all that, so uh, it's great. Uh, are you recycling? Oh yeah, I even have a compost heap. Really? Tell us about that, come over here. <laughs> Let, take your glasses off, I want the girls to see your eyes for a minute. <laughs> see, see girl? Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, if you go to the city, they give you a, a free compost bin, and uh, yeah, we've, we've been doing it for like, uh, I don't know, four or five months. It's working out great. Well, there you have it. Hey, right here at the Temecula Film Festival, I'm Pete Allman and Lucas Grabiel.